Tonight, you have the chance to help a veteran get a home, all by attending a party in the park. 17's Karen Hua joining us live from Strandler Park to show us how you can pitch in. Karen? Good evening, everyone. We're here. The festivities are about to kick off. There's going to be live music starting soon. Food trucks are everywhere. It's going to be a great time. This party is hosted by the California Veterans Assistance Foundation, and their mission is to create a veteran village of tiny homes. Now, the organizers say there are 83 homeless veterans in Kern County, and 40 of them live on the streets. So they're hoping to raise $300,000 to build 12 homes in Oildale on Covey Avenue. The houses are small, 400 square feet, but they're enough for a single veteran. The money raised tonight will go toward construction and furnishing costs. Now I'm here with Deb Johnson. She's the president of the California Veterans Assistance Foundation. Deb, why is this uh, such an important event to our community? Well, tomorrow we actually get to kick off our 20th annu annual um, Kern County Veterans Stand Down. So this is a really great opportunity to show the community what we are trying to do to help homeless veterans. Um, as you stated the numbers, we believe that the 12 homes that we're going to build for permanent housing for homeless veterans will get us to our goal, which is kind of like, uh, they call it functional zero. And what that means is that we're going to be able to house more veterans that become homeless than those that actually um, become homeless. And we can do that by having the housing in place, the supportive services in place. So that if somebody falls into homelessness, we can get them rapidly housed within 90 days. And putting new permanent housing up, this creative pilot project for our community is the first step in our organization's attempts to try to get to that functional zero with homeless veterans. Definitely. And you say this is one of the biggest events for veterans of the entire year. Tell people a little bit about how much fun they're going to have tonight. Okay. So tonight, like, you know, you, you kind of uh, stated everything. We're going to have some live music. We have a couple of food trucks. Um, but honestly, it's really about the community coming forward to help support us in these efforts. Because what we need, we need the community's help. And what we mean by that is obviously financial donations are always a benefit for us, but we need specialty skills, such as anybody who has carpentry skills, plumbing skills, um, electrical skills, roofing, concrete. If they want to step in and help us with this project, that will help us keep construction low. So that way we're able to charge lower rates for the veterans that are put into these permanent housing units. Well, thank you so much for all your work, Deb. We really appreciate it. To reiterate, everyone, come out tonight from 5 to 9 p.m. Stramler Park. That's 4003 Chester Avenue. Tickets are $10, and that includes a drink ticket. Uh, for all the more information, visit CAVAF.org. Reporting live at Stramler Park, I'm Karen Hua, 17 News. Karen, thank you.